So this is cool. A new children's book is asking an age-old question through the eyes of a bee. Local author Jasmine Eastburn joins us live from Roseville in the inspirational story. Of course, the question is, Billy B, what's it going to be? Hi, Jasmine. Hey, guys. How's it going today? Good. Good. This is so cute. Good morning. Cute. Okay, tell us all Thank about you so much. the idea behind this. What, what are we talking about here with Billy B? Absolutely. So Who is Billy the Bee going to be is a children's book that is dyslexia friendly and also non-binary. I had a girlfriend who was pregnant uh, probably about two years ago and she said, you know, I love boy and girl books, but I just can't find any non-binary books for my kiddo. And I was like, gosh, I'm going to put that in my brain and, and remember that. And then COVID happened and um, my art job, I'm not able to do that anymore right now. So I decided to write a book, and I got together with a local um, illustrator, Michaela Paul, and she did all the illustrations. She's also from the Sacramento area. Awesome. And I'm just so excited to get this book out there, especially being dyslexia-friendly. I have a dyslexic child, and finding a dyslexia-friendly book is almost impossible. <laughs> so I'm really excited for this. So how do you, how is it uh, uh, differentiated so that it's a dyslexia friendly book? Like what would parents need to watch for so that they know that that is in fact the case? Absolutely. So um, this is a dyslexia friendly font. It's called Open Dyslexia. You can actually get it online and you can use it if you wanted to use for homework or school papers or something like that. It's a great access tool. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's, that's how I used it. That is so interesting. Isn't that cool? Okay, cool. Uh, take us through the book here because I'm fascinated. I want to know what happens to Billy. I mean, don't give away the ending, right, but right. Uh, you know, what's what's Billy <laughs> trying out for here? Absolutely. So Billy is having that age-old question: Who am I going to be when I grow up? The book is dedicated to my kiddos, obviously. So it's just kind of going through here. What am I going to be? Am I going to be a gardener? I really love helping with the seeds in spring. Mm -hmm. And then yes. you get really great tomatoes. I love it. So it's just kind of walking through that story there. And then at the end, Gigi, who uh, is the parental uh, person in this book, uh, kind of helps Billy find out what they want to be when they grow up. I love this. So Jasmine, how can moms and dads get a hold of Billy B? Absolutely. So Billy, the, who is Billy the Bee going to be is available on all e-commerce book websites, so Amazon, Walmart, uh, Barnes and Nobles. You can also purchase it directly through my website, www.firesoulgraceheart.com. I've switched my website around, so you will land directly on, this, on the page about Billy the Bee. Um, I do have other things on the website, my art and stuff, but this is what's on the front page right now. Right Fantastic. On. Congratulations. Yeah. Great it's, idea. Thank it's so you. hard getting a book done, and you did it. You did it during these hard times, too. <laughs> Cody, you need to do it. I hear you, you want to do it. You better get on it. Get on him, Jasmine. You better get on it. Right, thanks, I'm going to pay attention. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to check in with you. <laughs> I Love believe it. you, too. <laughs> Thank you, Jasmine. Thank you, Jasmine. <laughs> a local